Hey Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the week of the 8th to the 14th of November. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading so it may not resonate for everybody. So please take what does and leave what doesn't. So let's see what the universe has for you lovely Aquarians. Let's look at the overall picture. Ooh, the Empress. Okay, we have the Empress already. Let's see what's been happening recently with you guys. Mm -hmm. Ah, lovely card, but way too many fell out. Okay, oops. Okay. Oh, great card. Nine of one, nine of pentacles. <laughs> nine of pentacles. Seven of cups. Okay. Seven of cups, and then we have. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, hey, Aquarius. Um, you are you are getting really successful in your field. There is something um, that you are working in. It's like it's either um, a field that you're an expertise in. Um, or something like a, a new opportunity. Opportunities are sort of being really uh, coming at you. You're, you're attracting a lot of great things for your wealth. Um, and there's something about your home life improving as well. Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, and the Eight of Pentacles. It's really um, showing that I, I, just, I just sense a lot of abundance here. November is a really interesting month for all the signs. Really interesting. It's, it's a lot more intense, but in very, very positive ways um, with money and with love. It's, it's, I mean, it's great. Nine of Pentacles. You guys are, you know, um, if you're single, you've been really enjoying being single as well because um, other parts of your life is really getting very successful. You know, there is sort of like um, fruits of your labor, is, is finally, it's reaping, you know, um, you're reaping what you sowed and, and it's really showing here with the seven of cups, you know, you're getting multiple, um, offers here. And also there is a, the, you're in a period of, I mean, I'm sure you're always attractive, but especially in this period, I just get the sense that you're like turning heads. <laughs> You're turning heads. And here with the Eight of Pentacles, you're going to find that people are really wanting to um, work with you, hang around with you, be with you in that sense. You know, you will be getting um, more kind of unexpected offers that you weren't, you know, you didn't think that uh, it was going to come so quickly. Um, if it's work, yeah, you're going to get like if, projects that you're going to be working on. Um, it's just a lot. It's a lot. Like I, I want to say so much and it, it's just the energy is, is really, really strong uh, this time, Aquarius. Gosh. The, um, also in terms of a love connection, um, <laughs> I just get the sense that this there's a connection around you and especially here with the Seven of Cups, um, you make them feel weak in the knees. That's what I'm getting. There's something you're just being so magnetic and attractive these days. Um, Eight of Cups. Okay, let's see what follows on with that. Ooh, Ace of Pentacles. What did I tell you? There's a lot of amazing opportunities coming to you. Um, your finances are increasing. There's something, huge opportunity, huge a breakthrough, a breakthrough with things in your life, the temperance, okay, and current energies, the eight of cups, the ace of pentacles, and temperance, and you're finally moving towards, this is what it is, the eight of cups, it's something that, you know, you're not afraid of challenges, Aquarius, you're not afraid of challenges, you, you, you know, and I think that's what makes you so attractive also, is that um, you kind of thrive in them, you know, as well. Here in the Ace of Pentacles, something is shining. Something is kind of like um, a treasure of not only work, but a treasure of love is coming in. And the Temperance here is showing that, um, you know, let's, um, let's be balanced about this. Let's have a clear head about this. You know, here with Temperance, you have like 
this this light shining through here on top it's you're magnetic you're um you're able to manifest things really well aquarius i think you're going to be in the zone of like being a manifesto master a master of manif uh, manifestation basically um and it's powerful you know and you just have to also keep your feet firmly on the ground also that's what's coming to me now one is you know on the land one is in the water as long as you're able to balance those parts of your life then all is good uh but yeah major opportunity coming a major offer of love also oh ace of cups oh my goodness could you be any more abundant? I was saying there's a strong sense of abundancy here. And then we get the Ace of Cups with Ace of Pentacles and Ace of Cups. I mean, <laughs> I'm, I know I'm sounding really excited for you because that's, I am. I mean, this feeling is so strong here. Oh, and the Page of Swords. There is, um, oh, wow. Okay. Okay. You see how strong all of this is? Um Okay, so the Seven of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. Oh, wow. There is this abundance of so much success, of this love, of this peace, of this. And you're going you're gonna to be really good at being able to maneuver things so you get um, things on a roll, you know, if that makes sense. Basically, balance. Page of Swords, you know, this, there is some, someone new. There is someone new coming in. Um, it's this connection, this love connection here. Uh, they kind of want to um, they get, want to get your attention. You know, they've been trying to get your attention because you've been sort of like flying high and stuff. I think they they um, they admire that, and I think they are finding it more fun in that way to get your attention, if that makes any sense. But there's this love coming in and uh, sort of like wanting to swoop you up in that sense. And then here with the Seven of Pentacles, I, I think I said earlier, you know, kind of like um, it's the fruits of your labor. It's finally going to show, you know, it's it's you're reaping what you sowed. And here that's what it's showing with the Seven of Pentacles. Um, it's completely confirmed what I was saying with the Ace of Swords. Finally, you get, you know, the um, under one roof, all of it, basically. And it's, it's this clarity, it's this victorious feeling that you're getting. You really are on your way to something great here, Aquarius. It, it, it is something great. That's what I'm getting. It's a greatness of... Um, of prosperity in your professional side of things, but also in love, you know, this prosperity in love. You're going to see things very, very clearly. And um, this new love here is, is rearing to go with you. And it's a really beautiful young love, you know, young as in not, not necessarily age, not at all, but young as in um, it's fresh, you know, it's sort of just at the beginning of things. And if you are with somebody, it could be like a new zest in your love life also with the current person. There's just something so fresh and, and pure here. That's what I'm getting. And, you know, a pat on your back, of course, because you've been doing really well with work, you know. Um, the chariot, yes. Yeah, you're definitely heading in the right direction here. Um, and I was talking about balance and you are able to maintain that, you know, and focus. It's like you've got your, your, um, what do you call them? Those blinkers, you know, with the horse, what the horses wear and you've just, you just, you're going for it. It's like you have that strength now and it's not going to. Um, stop anytime soon. The justice card. Yeah, balance, 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 balance. That's what I was saying. I really love it when the cards confirm. Um, and that's, that's exactly what's showing here. Justice. You know, Aquarius, you've worked hard for this, um, your passion. That's what I see here. Your passion, your work, your love life. You've worked hard for it and now it's blossoming. It's really blossoming. You get that justice for your hard work. Gosh, it's such so abundant, so abundant, so abundant. Okay, 
one last card let's see for Aquarius please one last card to clarify maybe oh and the wall look at that look at that oh my gosh this is such a great spread a great a great reading <laughs> the wall card one last card the wall card yes it has confirmed everything um aquarius you are just flying high you're ascending to the top you you really are believe in yourself it's happening you are a, a master of of um of manifesting things remember that you're a master of manifesting things and it's all happening so beautifully so abundantly um and it's you know you are victorious in each and every way of this uh victorious and here we get the justice this is wonderful you're gonna see the uh, opportunities here opening up and you're gonna grab it while you can um and the love gosh yeah you, you know it, left right and center but this one new love it's gonna feel so fresh and exciting for you aquarius i really hope you enjoyed that um if you like the reading please like share and subscribe and um I'm loving this. I really look forward to seeing you in the next reading. Thank you so much.